Yeah, welcome back to the show. You know what, we are just really besides ourselves here because we have with us former Cavs player, Mr. Bingo Smith, who was a shooting guard for the Cavs. And so, welcome to the show. So good to have you here. Well, thank you. Very much. Hey, Bingo. And I'm Anthony sorry. is that beside was, himself. That was funny. That I'm was. Sorry. But you know what? I think we can. We, we can, made it through. We'll make it through. We're going to yeah. make it through this. All right. Yeah. So, welcome to the show. Thank you. So, you know, again, uh, uh, nine years here with the Cavs. Uh, and nine years, yes. <laughs> and, uh, fun uh, years. Nine fun years. <laughs> yes. Wow. Well, let's let's go back and talk about how you came to the Cavs. And you know, I from my notes, there were eleven players who were drafted at the same time as you. Yes. And you stayed the longest. Want to talk yes. about those days? Well, those days were burning days, and. Uh, we had a terrible team, to tell the truth. We won the one 15 games two years in a row, and then all of a sudden we started adding good players, and uh, we became the Miracle Wizards. We were in '76, and everything is history. Everything else is history. So that was the the miracle of Richfield. Of Richfield yes. Those years. I'm gonna go back even further. further. And okay. Just let everyone know that you know. Bingo is actually from Memphis, Tennessee. Memphis, yes. And from there, you actually, did you think you were ever going to play basketball when you were growing up? Not growing up, no. It was just a thing to do during that time period to keep me out of trouble. Keep you out <laughs> of trouble, huh? Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, what about brothers and sisters? Did you have brothers and sisters to get in uh, trouble with, or were the friends? <laughs> no, they were older. My three older brothers were at least eight years older than I was, so... I did get a chance to hang with them too much. I, I ran from them. They were grown people to me. Right. So now you ended up going to the University of Tulsa, correct? University of Tulsa, yes. Okay, and you had opportunity to, you know, to work on, on, on your skills and play basketball there. But that's actually where you got the nickname Bingo. Yes, it was. Uh, my senior year in college, there were three Bobby Smiths in Oklahoma. Oh, okay. And I was <laughs> up All-American, and my... Uh, Public there, he said, uh, we got to find something to distinguish you from those two. So he said, how about bingo? I said, bingo? My mother ain't named me no bingo. <laughs> no, <that's right. laughs> you know? But it worked, and it worked real well, and I use it today. So okay. you you kind of accepted it. So now you have you grown to love the name, or are you still like, I my mother it. didn't name okay. me bingo? I don't even remember. My real so, name is, uh, Robert. Robert. <laughs> okay, so Bingo traveled you all the way to San Diego when you first started with the Rockies. Yes, that was I your did. First season. Yes, I did. Uh, that was a good experience, too. Lovely weather. It was a terrible team. I don't know why I keep getting these. <laughs> Uh, I get the team that's terrible. When I leave, they get good. Yeah, because you you're you're there to make them great. Set the foundation. Yes. I think you're, you're right. Set the, set yeah, the, set the, I think so that's after it. that first year season, then you came and did nine years here with the Cavs. Nine years with the Cavs. And then you retired with your eleventh year. Went back to San Diego. This and that time, time was with called the Clippers. Clippers. The San Diego Clippers. Ah, another bad team. Another bad. You know, oh, so we, but it was a great time. We learning. found out in eleven seasons you played over eight hundred and sixty-five games total. Well, I didn't miss many. I was very fortunate at that time. I didn't get injured a lot. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Sprint ankles like everybody normally get playing pro ball. But uh, bad knees, bad back, I didn't have those. No. <laughs> so you know, I know you, we've had some other Cavalier greats on the stage at, mm -hmm. in the past. And, yes. you know, and I'm quite sure, you know, people like Austin Carr and, yeah. and Campy, Campy Russell yeah. you have worked with and played with. What was it like being on the, uh, just on the same court with them? Well, you know, being one of the older people that played with the Cavs when they came out, I had been there a couple of years, uh, just the learning process of watching them grow. Mm -hmm. uh, they become superstars that they became, and it gave me great pleasure to know that I had something to do with that. Yeah. You know, uh, when they came, it's all Americans, uh, it was told to me, well, you won't be here long now. We got Campy. After the first practice, I said, no problem. I'll be here. Because I know Campy had the talent, but he didn't have the knowledge. Oh. Right. So, yeah, and, and that is, I'm sure that knowledge is 
what led the Cavs to that, that playoff season. Oh, right? it certainly was. It certainly was. We we also, yeah, so oh, yeah. what was that, 70, 70, 76. 76. 70, 75, okay. 76 okay. season. Okay, yeah. yeah. We also got a player named Nate Thurman, too. Okay, I know that We name. got him that year, and he also brought a lot of maturity to the team. And uh, we learned a little from him, and I hope a little from me. And uh, we had a great season. Okay. So give me your thoughts mm -hmm. on the current yes. Cavaliers yeah. this past season. Mm -hmm. Well, to be honest with you, I thought that uh, they had a rough time during the playoffs. It wasn't indicative of what that team could do. They had a fantastic team, a great leader in, in LeBron James. And, you know, you go through a, a port of the season, portion of the season that you play well and you don't play well. And so far for us, we played poorly during the playoffs. It's a bad timing for us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you still keep the faith. I mean, what are your predictions for when we're going to go all the way? Well, Tell the truth, I think next year may be a good year to do it. Okay. okay. This year should have been the year, but yes. like, like I said, we had a bad portion there in the playoffs. I think next year we're going to correct all those, in, those things, that injuries and stuff like that, and we should go all the way. Okay, okay. Ooh. Well, it is so good to have you on, yeah. Mr. Robert Bingo, Bingo. Smith. Uh, yeah. My name, oh, thank <laughs> God, yes, thank you. <laughs> Probably nobody sent your mom, huh? Robert. <laughs> That's <yeah>. true. <laughs> anyway, thanks again. Oh, thank you for having me. Okay. So now we're going to go to a commercial and come back and wrap up the show. Stay with us. We'll be 